the rest of my life when I was leaving school. I'm sure that some people can relate to that right now. And uh, to do the piece, I need a volunteer. <clears throat> Young lady, what's your name? Yamina? Yeah. Give it up for Yamina! <laughs> I promise uh, I will not violate your rights in any way. <laughs> Uh, you mean that you're now six years old, first grader, and we're going to have a frank conversation about what you want to do with the rest of your life. And you've already told me what you want to do with the rest of your life, through ESP and through me just kind of getting the vibe of you as a six-year-old. You're welcome to contribute in any way to this piece. Uh, if you guys you want to say, you're welcome to say it in a conversation. And we're just going to kind of talk about the future, you know? It's when you want to do what you want to do, you have to work really hard. You chose one of the types of professions out there. You're serious. You want to do this. Yeah, You're talking like you're 22 years old right now. <laughs> <laughs> if you want this, you have to work until your six-year-old heart explodes in your chest. You can't rest until you're so tired you want to melt right into the ground. You mean if you want to grow up to be a robot, you cannot fuck around! <laughs> Your grandma's loose change jar, it's gonna take you a lifetime to fill it. You gotta think like a robot. You gotta talk like a robot. You gotta move, you gotta squawk, you gotta rock like a robot. This ain't no Jolly Baldy Robo Magic Go Go Gadget habit. <laughs> Alright, let's practice. Okay, okay, right. Not yet, not yet. Back on the stage. <laughs> I appreciate the enthusiasm. <laughs> it's lost lovers, lost weekend, lost beautiful hair. But you gotta tell me why you want this. Yeah. I want this because because you want this. <laughs> That's the extent of the whole lifestyle. I want this because the side is backwards. I'm talking never eating leftover split pea soup again. Very clever, by the way. <laughs> Take my shirt and then turn it around for the audience. <laughs> I'm talking, you've got all your favorite meals loaded on a data cards. And every time you want one, you just wipe your memory, it's just like the first time. You can move chess pieces with your mind. My friend Burrito's gonna be high, you can play movies on your islands while you're falling asleep, which you don't even have to do because robots don't have bedtimes. <laughs> like a bulletproof cement mixer. You can unscrew your arm at parties and use it to tap jokes in the shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> and if someone makes fun of you, it's cool because the robot doesn't cry, even though you can still feel deeply. Don't laugh, alright? It's serious business. You can do anything you want to do. When you don't stub your tongue on crap, crap stubs its tongue on you. <laughs> Have I made my point? You want something so bad, you crush it in your claw, you've got to make a decision. I mean, are you going to grow up to be CEO? You're gonna grow up to see 3PO. <laughs> I know you. You're the kid who take the silver and gold colored pencils first. You rub them down in nubs before you reach for anything else, and I do not give a crap if you're still a first grade, Amina. Okay? Don't apologize to me. You gotta look within. This is why you separate yourself from the future firemen and astronauts of America. Well, today's career day chief, they're going to go around the circle in your first grade class and you'll get asked last and they'll laugh, but remember, you've got two big brass lug nuts and a mug that's anything but cute, and if three times they tell you no, three times you tell them, that's not be cute. <laughs> someday, someday you'll be dating technology. And first, we'll use your tiny as a fancy antique ashtray. And then we'll get robot butt cancer that's tricky for your parts away from them. <laughs> but you have no mother to cry to because robots don't have mothers and your programmer died decades ago. <laughs> but if you can live with this harsh reality, the good times will be good. And they'll sustain you. Well, she was in the anyway. I'm going to say, man.
Thank you very much. Thank you very much. 